Today, we'll talk about recent Bitcoin price action. Have we all traded and invested in the right points? Then we will move back to our core education by learning the right timing in entries. You will see how the market makers chop the price to confuse you. So much to learn. If you are ready, let's start. I would like to start this video by talking about Bitcoin. So what happened with Bitcoin? As you know, all we waiting and pointing out this weekly imbalance and a possible bounce around here. You can also notice how price are powered up by using these equal laws beside the weekly imbalance. This was also the level of the previous month's low level and institutional level. So, too many things come together to power Bitcoin up. Let's go down to the daily charts and talk more. The first thing you must understand, imbalances are not enough to push the price all the time. Because we do not know how much the price will fill the imbalance. This is why we look for a shift in structure. You can notice this weak market structure breaking right here. This brings us our first structure box to the live to look for entries. And the BPR area is a great location to search for entries. From here, Bitcoin is kept boosted to higher prices. This was the brief history of BTC. I'm sure most of you caught this nice, obvious move. Let's get back to our main education over momentum trading. We will check this RSR coin. You'll notice exactly the same thing with Bitcoin, but this time the 4 hour chart because of the price action is fractal. Price taps this 4 hour imbalance area and also sweeps the previous day low, then boosts it up to clear the previous weekly high above. Let's drop to the 5 minute charts and talk more. Exactly the same price movement. Structure shifts here and price gains momentum upwards. After each break, the new imbalance or order block areas gives us the power to look for quick scalp entries, such as 2R in and out. As you can see, the same thing keeps happening over and over, giving you a lot of quick scalping chances. Remember, you write the momentum until it is broken. Do not think about where the price will return. This is not your concern. Keep following momentum structure boxes as much as you can. Some entries will be missed and some prices never pull back. That is natural. As you can see, at some point, the protected law fails. Buyers finally weaken. Let's recap again. What happened here? Price is reacting to this giant 4R imbalance area and the momentum pushing up. Keep creating structure boxes and new imbalances. You scalp each of these small movements by using 2R or even 1.5R setups. Quick in and out as much as you can until the momentum is broken. Remember, no momentum will go forever. Buyers or sellers will fail at some point. Here you can see how the buyers failed right at this point and sellers took the control. However, remember, this is top gainer coin. All we want to write it upwards. Sellers cannot keep up and lose the power the buyers again. This moment here is a manipulation box. But right in this example, buyers are so powerful and price never pulls back. This is the cruel reality of trading. You may wait for hours without a clear entry. That is out of your control. Let's talk about people USDT. I have traded this coin so much in recent weeks. It was a joy. When you look at the price moment here with 15 minutes 
even hourly charts, you'll see the same thing. Large green candlesticks keep moving upwards. It is extremely powerful. Now, let's drop to the one minute to understand what happens inside these large high time frame candlesticks. Those clear candlesticks look ugly when we switch to the one minute time frame. For example, look at this area. No clear breaks, no clear entries, only confuses you. We wait for three clear things. Clear break, clear imbalance, clear order block. And you can notice similar clear structure boxes afterward. Okay, what is the lesson here? What is the idea? We need to discuss this clearly. Okay, we understand this. In high time frames, there is a rally, a top gainer momentum. So, how can we trade it in lower time frames? The problem is lower time frames can be really messy like this one here. In some sections, price will move extremely fast. You will never have a chance to enter. In other sections, the price will be very choppy with very little noisy movement and you'll be confused when entering a trade. However, during all these movements, there will be times, very clear, very clear breaks, imbalances and order blocks to use and scalp it. You must wait for them. As we all traders, we want perfect price action, but in reality, this extremely clear price action rarely happens. You must accept the idea price will never move perfectly. All the aim of the market makers is to make you lose money. They will never move the price in a perfect line. They will mess up the price so you'll be confused. So, patience is your only weapon in trading. You must be patient and learn to wait for the clear price action and right timing. Otherwise, you'll be a seafood for the market makers all day long. Believe me, it is so easy to lose money. I hope that you enjoyed this video. We talked about great topics today. We will discuss more and more in the future. Take care for now. See you soon. If you have completed the free trading course and feel like you improved your trading skills, but you need more an extra, a boost, and you want to move to the next level in your trading life, my master class is ready for you. You'll learn liquidity, inefficiencies, and structure mastery deeply. And we will look at forward and reverse trading with momentum super boxes. You will learn how to confirm your entries with magic alignment system. Finally, you'll discover a strategy called yo-yo strategy, which will open new doors for you about taking and managing trades. If you are interested, you can find links on my website on the description. Take care friends, manage your risks and stay safe.